Hi guys, Mini Place here, bringing you another Color Zen video. So today we're going to be starting the playthrough. Uh, we're going to hopefully be able to play every level. So there's 20 levels, I believe, in each pack, or 25, 20 in each chapter. So there's 120 in Classic, 120 in Reflection, 120 in Serenity, 100 in Nature. So we're going to play through all the levels eventually, and we'll hopefully go in order. It's going to take a while though, because we're going to get stuck on some levels. Let me tell you. Alright, so I've already played these levels before, so this is going to be a pretty easy episode. So basically, for anyone that's new to this game, uh, also this game is on a ton of platforms. I think it's on mobile as well. I was actually looking into it a few minutes ago. It's on Wii U, which is what I'm playing on now. Uh, it's on Switch, although you have to use a pointer unless you're playing in handheld. That's why I'm playing on Wii U, because I've got the gamepad, and I've already got the full game. Uh, there is a demo as well. I believe it's on iOS and Android as well, so... Uh, it costs about £2.99, £2.99, so it's a very cheap game if you're looking into buying a puzzle game. So basically, you just have to fill the screen with the border colour, and any of the pulsing uh, pulsing ones you can move. I can't move the circle, I can move the triangle. Yeah, it's on mobile, that's good. Yeah. Yeah, I never actually knew it was on mobile, but yeah, apparently it is. Uh, obviously, I can't hit the light blue um, because the pink is in the way, so we've got to hit the pink first and then the light blue. Uh, and obviously every level, well not every level, but yeah, you've got to fill the screen with that colour last. So we have to do the pink first, then the light blue. Uh, this will get more interesting eventually, trust me. <laughs> Alright, so now it's orange, so we're going to do pink and light blue. Or we could have done light blue and pink, there's multiple ways of doing each level. Uh, next we need to do orange, so we're going to do light blue, then orange. Yeah, so I believe the demo on Switch is what I have, but I didn't really want to buy the game again, and I'd have to use a pointer. Obviously, I can't capture... Uh... Ah, see, I've done that in the wrong order. I failed that. So, we've got to do the light blue first, and then do the dark blue, because the dark blue was protected by the light blue. That's why I failed that one. I wasn't focused. <laughs> Alright. Uh, this one, alright, getting a bit more confusing now. There's no other light blue, so I might as well get rid of that first. Uh, there is an orange on the inside of the uh, this shape and this shape, so I might as well get rid of orange first. Although I do need to get orange eventually. Get rid of pink, because that's all we can do, and then orange. Yeah, if anyone has any questions about this game, feel free to ask. I'm going to be doing roughly... I plan to do one puzzle playthrough at a time in the future, so... If you have any questions on the games I plan to play through, then uh, give me a shout and then I'll be able to answer them, hopefully. Okay. I'm going to get rid of the the blue first, because I have to get rid of that red as well. There's only one other red. There's this red, there's the one I can't move in the bottom left, and there's that red. I need to get rid of that. Um, pink. Get rid of blue. Orange. Okay. Alright, I just need to check how long... Alright, yeah, I'm just going to play till half past. That should do. That should do it. Uh, I'll probably do two episodes today, but I am going to play this quite a bit. If only it wasn't on... Um, the full version I had wasn't on Wii U. If it was on Switch, I would play this a ton more, because it's a really good game, and there's a lot of levels that I'll need to complete. Okay, get rid of the pinks, the light blues, the orange. I'm starting to wonder if this will be a good speed game. <laughs> I know I say that about every game, but I'm wondering. It'll be a lot to learn, and it'll just be like. It will get to a point where it's just, like, so difficult to PB, and you just do the same thing over and over. So I, I doubt it would be, but it could be interesting to run a game like this. I was thinking of running Captain Toad, actually, which is going to be my next puzzle playthrough. But that's the Wii U version. Will be a good speed game. Yeah, I don't know. It would take a lot of learning. I mean, you could just do individual, like, chapters. I, I would submit this game, to be honest, to speedrun.com. You could just do individual chapters. I mean, anyone can speedrun chapter one, because it's only 20 easy levels. So yeah, only posting objects can be moved if you didn't already realise that. Uh, I think that's something I struggled with when I first got this game, because it only tells you on this level. My replies are probably so late because second mobile, but Captain Toad was also, would also be awesome. Yeah, yeah, it's all right. Mobile delay is annoying, but it's all right.
Yeah, I'm going to be playing through Captain Toad as the next puzzle game. Maybe at the same time as this. I'm not sure. But... Ah, I failed. Okay. I want to... Alright, I'm going to do my final move as the dark blue's on the inside of those four. Okay. Um. Right. There's only three dark blues, so we can't touch them yet. We just have to get rid of everything else. Literally everything else. This should be an easy level because there's literally nothing blocking anything. It's literally just all there. We should be fine with this level. Yeah, pretty easy level. Yeah, so I plan to do this game and then Captain Toad. Uh, I don't really have anything planned for after that, but I feel like Captain Toad will keep, you, keep me occupied for a while, and I'll definitely find another puzzle game in the meantime. Maybe I'll even play some Microsoft Mahjong or something. <laughs> ah, I failed. Okay, we're on level 15. Time flies with this game really, really fast. Okay. We can get rid of the pink, because there's only the pink there to worry about. We can get rid of the green, same thing. We can get rid of the blue, light blue. Dark blue has to be last. I don't know how I failed that, to be honest, but I did. Yeah, I was really... I don't know. I, I had this in mind for a while, like, to play a puzzle game as a playthrough. But, like, I didn't know how people would feel, would feel about it. I don't know. It's a bit, like... Yeah. Puzzles on stream always increase the mental workload. Exactly. <laughs> and obviously I have to check chat as well, so... I don't know. I mean, good thing is, playing the game like this on stream... If I get stuck, I can ask chat, so, you know, playing this offline, you get stuck on one level, you just, you can't do it, and then you inevitably have to look it up. But with games like this, like, there's probably going to be less walkthroughs of them, three times the things to pay attention to, with chat and everything, yeah, definitely. Also, how are you doing, Joe? How are you doing today? Yeah, Captain Toad, I feel like it's going to be a harder game to play, because this game's pretty simplistic, good game to start with. Because Captain Toad, I've seen speedruns of Captain Toad, and getting 100% is difficult. <laughs> Not really difficult, but just takes a long time to realise where everything is. Doing well, just got up. Nice. I don't actually remember what time zone you're in. Possibly in America, because if you just got up, I'm guessing so. Yeah, America. Yeah, I guessed. Okay. Surely getting to the end of the chapter now. 19. There's 20 in each chapter. Or 20 in each, Yeah, 20 in each chapter. And there's 6 chapters in Classic. So hopefully we can do Classic all in one episode. Hopefully we can do 2 chapters this episode. The music isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. That was a one massive issue I was going to have with this game, and that was the music. But thankfully, that's not an issue anymore. I failed it. There's no more light blues. Right, so I have to get rid of them first, and then the light blue. I'm definitely going to speedrun this game. <laughs> Whether it's just single chapters or if it's whole like packs of like classic like whatever I decide to run I'm gonna run this game probably might as well give it a go okay so this one introduces white circles so if you if you combine a white circle with a pink it will produce pink as I just did if you do it on this it will produce yellow there you go pretty simple it gets pretty interesting in the end though okay so pink and pink yellow and yellow and then 
Obviously, there's no other light blues, so I'll use the white. Uh, I am instead of combining light blue with light blue here, I I have two whites I need to get rid of. So I'm gonna combine a white with a light blue and a white with a yellow. This looks like an advanced mobile game on Switch. It is a mobile game, actually. I didn't even realise it was a mobile game until I was looking into the price. But it is actually a mobile game. It's a good mobile game, though. And it's only um, $2.99. So definitely a good game to pick up. There's a free demo if you want to give it a go. There was a bit of lag there as well. If anyone's wondering. Because it's not the capture card. Okay, that's good. Yeah, see? <laughs> Easy to spot a mobile game. You can spot a mobile game from a, a mile away. Okay, let me... Yep. Alright. Yeah, so it's on it's on Switch as well. Um, but I'm playing on Wii U. Proof. <laughs> I'm playing on Wii U because I have the full game on Wii U. And I didn't really want to buy it again. And if I play on Switch, I will have to. I will have to use a pointer, and it's so awkward to play with a pointer. I'd much rather play with a uh, touch screen. With, although it does involve a lot of looking down, but I'm sure everyone's used to that when my 3D World run runs. Okay. Yeah. So these levels are pretty simple to start off with so pretty basic episode one but i'll probably upload episode two pretty much like two days after this because i upload on monday wednesday friday now on youtube so i guess i'll just ah damn it i guess i'll just upload episode one and two which is what i'm going to record today There you go. Like directly after each other, instead of leaving a gap like I normally do and uploading a different game. I've got a ton of Smash I need to upload as well, so I've got some content for the next couple of weeks. Okay. Get rid of the red. There's a lot of whites I need to get rid of here, but it is kind of throwing me off. Because. Like, there's not that many. Yeah, never mind. There is. Okay. Right. This is going to take some learning if I'm going to do this as a speed game. It's going to take some serious learning. Alright, good. Okay, I also need to add your um, weapon to the queue header. I'll make sure I do that in a second. Okay, so just for just to show everyone what a white plus white does, that's what it does. Makes a noise. <laughs> Makes a noise and combines into white, obviously. Alright. But obviously if I do that, then I'm going to be getting rid of four of my whites, which I kind of need. Uh, gonna combine my whites here. Gonna get rid of them all. Now I don't need any more. Just get rid of the yellow. Don't really need it. Although there is still a yellow there, but I can just use that. Okay, there is actually a glitch in this game. And I've done it before. Or a trick, I guess. Not really a glitch. Where you can hit two whites at the same time. I don't know if that's going to be useful for speedrunning. Probably will be. One less movement or something. But that will be something I'll have to work out. Although obviously every level is intended to be completed without using that trick. So I probably won't need that for the playthrough. And it's pretty difficult to pull off anyway. By the way, let me know if the music is a good level or not, because I don't want it to be too loud. Or 
anything because it can be kind of repaired. Okay, I thought I failed, but I didn't. A lot of the time, I would just completely lock out on these levels, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm gonna start speedrun this game, and I'm gonna struggle the heck out of this. <laughs> okay, don't need pink. Music's good? Okay, great. Right, I don't need whites anymore. I think I've missed out. Yeah, I'm gonna have one pink. That's fine. 16. Maybe we'll get up to chapter 3 in this episode. Surprising progress. But it's not gonna continue like that. Not with levels like these. Okay, there is two purples on the insides of these. So if I get rid of a purple now, I'll be fine. I really want to combine a white, but I don't think that was a good idea. Nah. Okay. Shouldn't have done that. Problem is, I don't know where to go from here. I've got one more. I've got another white in there. Yep, there you go. Ah, see, I almost missed it out. Almost. Okay. That's a different shade. That's the same as the inside of this. I need to use this white on the red, otherwise I can't get rid of it. Perfect. Alright. Using my brain a little bit now. <laughs> Something I really struggle with on this channel. I guess I could just use pink. Because I don't really need pink after this. There's an awful lot of white there blocking this. I feel like I'm just going to need to use it. I'm going to need to use this white on another white just to get rid of all the excess I don't need. Definitely. Wait, no, yellow is the background colour. I wouldn't have been able to throw that away. Right. Perfect. Yeah, there was way too much white there. You were never going to be able to use all that. Okay, this is a level I struggled with the other day, when I was playing again on Switch. See, now it's just got rid of the red here. Oh, you only have to single tap the background to pause. I thought it was double tap. Okay, I just... Oh, I thought I completed it first try. I was going to say, I literally took ages on this the other day. Like a good 5 to 10 minutes on this one level. Picked it up again. That would be yellow this time. Hey Purpose, how are you doing? Game makes no sense. That that would have been pure luck. I 
if I did that. I was just messing around at the end because I thought I failed. I'm heading off. Oh, I'm heading to Top Golf shortly with some of my family. Nice. Good luck. Good luck with golf. Hope it goes well. Not much midi concentration face. Gonna, gonna, gonna need to get used to it with the playthroughs. <laughs> with the um, puzzle playthroughs. But yeah, I'm definitely willing to make this a common theme on the channel now. Nah, you, you can't do that. I was thinking you could do the white and then quickly move over to the red. But no, you can't do that. They thought about that. Yeah, this is definitely going to require more concentration than Captain Toad for some levels. It's definitely more of a basic game, though. But, I mean, Captain Toad is good because it's a puzzle game and it's Mario-related because I play a lot of Mario on this channel, so it just makes sense to play through Captain Toad at some point. I'm just kind of doing stuff at this point. <laughs> I'm just kind of doing stuff and hoping. It's weird not uh, not seeing me stream Saltoon. I mean, I don't always stream Saltoon. I, I was going to play Mario Kart after this because I'm not going to be doing a massive stream today. Only about two hours, possibly. Going to be streaming to about six, hopefully. I want to do at least an hour of this, but I don't know if I'm even going to do any other game today. I might even do two hours of this. Depends what people want. But I do like viewer games. Viewer games are good. I've messed it up again. Wait, no I haven't. Easy. That is my thought. You're going to hear that an awful lot of this game. I messed it up, wait, no I didn't. <laughs> gonna hear it an awful lot. Alright, I have to use... There's no other dark blue here, so I have to use that on a white. I'm not bothered what you play. I'm glad I'm glad that's how I can be at this point. Like, most people will watch, doesn't matter what I'm playing, as long as they're able to watch. I'm glad that's how I'm able to be at this point, because, like, a year ago, I wouldn't have been able to say that. Like, I've made definitely made some progress on Twitch this year where well, I'm just able to play pretty much anything just do whatever you want to do and I'm sure we'll be happy if you're happy exactly I'm just glad I can be like that nowadays because back in the day like at least a year ago I couldn't really be like that to be honest like you just look at my YouTube and it's just completely changed like it's went from pretty much all like the three mobile games I used to play to pretty much, well, no mobile at all, and playthroughs now, which is new to the channel. You was watching the 602? Nice. I was watching a bit of the 602 today. I was going to raid someone that was doing the 602, but I decided against that. Yeah, not many people have been doing it. Well, not, not really not many people, but, I mean, it is a long marathon, so you'd expect it, but... Yeah. I mean, that was my main, like, like, people would ask me if I would ever do a 602, and I'd be like, uh, I mean, it's it's 24 hours, so no. Well, that's 24 hours if you're good. Like, with my ability in the games at this point, I would probably take, like, 40 hours. So, I mean, I mean I've never completed Mario 64, so... You know, I've literally got like 12 stars in that game, and I'm going to do a playthrough of that one day. Alright, I've messed this up. No, I've literally not even got yellow. Why am I even continuing? Okay.
have to use a... Yeah. Perfect. Mario 64 playthrough? Yes. Yeah, you did hear correctly. I'm going to be doing a Mario 64 playthrough at some point. Anyway, literally perfect timing to end off that episode. Um, I believe it's been about half an hour now. Probably just less. About 27, 28 minutes. But I'm going to end off the episode there. Thank you all for watching and peace out.